The Gra, the Vilna Gain, when he was on his deathbed, he held up his tzitzis, these little tassels that Jewish men wear on a four-cornered garment. And he held up these strings that we wear all day, we don't even know we're wearing them. And he held them up in his hand, and he was crying. And he said, I'm so sad to leave this world, this world of doing, this world of accomplishment. This world where a easy mitzvah, such as putting on this garment, will allow you to greet Hashem face to face, to greet His Shechina, His presence. I'm so sad to leave a world where that can be accomplished so easily. And to go to a world where for all the money, I won't get a chance to do such a mitzvah. crying to leave this world, the world of action, the world where every moment crackles, the world where from one amain we should go out, call the whole community to our house and make a kiddush and be celebrating and everyone should come to our house and we should have all the unbelievable meats there And we should be celebrating the best drinks, the best food, and pack the house and everyone will come in and they'll say, Rabbi Nisan, what are you celebrating? And I'll say, oh, I had the craziest opportunity today. An opportunity that comes once in a lifetime, in fact, once in the universe's lifetime. And they'll say, what was it? Oh, what was it, Rabbi? You got to tell us what was it? I'll say, I said, amen. I said, I put on my tzitzis. I made a blessing. I prayed to Hashem. I did an act of kindness. I learned a word of Torah. Now they would think I'm crazy. But that's the truth. And then we should strike up the band and we should dance for hours. Because we got to do one moment, one mitzvah, because that's how much it's worth. That's how great those moments are if we would see them, if we would realize them, if we would recognize them.